What is going on everybody? My name is Pete and you guys are watching Pay to Drive and Pay to Drive Vlogs coming at you once again with another brand new video. Hope you're all doing fantastic out there. Ladies and gentlemen, if you drive for apps like Grubhub, DoorDash, Uber Eats or any of the others, you my friends are in the right place to stay up to date with what is going on in the gig economy. So get started right now for free. Hit that red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind it, hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know I'm doing a good job. And uh, yeah, leave a comment saying liked, L-I-K-E-D, and uh, let's jump on into this. So uh, this came from Darcy. And Darcy said the following. Hi, Pete. Darcy here. As I was watching the video regarding Walmart encouraging customers not to tip drivers, remember that one? I looked it up online and sure enough, the person who brought it to your attention for the video was absolutely correct. I then got on live chat with Walmart and asked why Walmart is doing this. I explained that I am a Walmart customer and I am a disabled person who does DoorDash. I wound up giving the I wound I wound up giving the number to call to bring my issue to the proper department for resolve. I placed the call with a screenshot of the phone number and length of call. I explained that oftentimes DoorDash pays two fifty to three fifty per delivery, and that we as drivers are responsible for our fuel expenses, brakes, tires, and all other vehicle maintenance and repairs, vehicle insurance, cell phone bills, which keeps us able to do deliveries, of course, and as independent contractors are responsible for federal and state taxes as self-employed and paying into Social Security, which is also true. Uh, along with being with people trying to support ourselves and our families. I explained that by Walmart corporate encouraging customers to not tip drivers, this can, is, and will further push drivers away from doing Walmart delivery. And I did say that in that video, so good catch, Darcy. Um, and that many of us are also Walmart customers, which means Walmart is hurting the very people who shop their stores and pushing us to quit shopping Walmart and put word of mouth into effect, which also will harm Walmart financially as they are pushing away their own customers by their don't tip the driver's policy. Now, I just want to pause for a second. As much as there is some truth in that, Darcy, that there are some drivers or some people that would hear this and say, oh, well, I'm not supporting Walmart anymore. This is true, but up until a certain point. Unfortunately, Walmart has monopolized so many areas in the country of being the place to go to shop for everything from groceries to just, you know, stuff you need around the house to, you know, whatever, whatever you need. Walmart is a one-stop shop. And Unfortunately, too many people rely on Walmart. So to, for them to just up and say, I'm not doing it anymore. I'm not going there. It's wishful thinking, man, honestly. But I, I, I totally get where you're coming from. I requested a phone call for this to be brought to the attention of upper management and, con and for contact via email. I provided my email address and expressed that I would greatly appreciate a response as quickly as possible as Walmart is not only hurting the financial well-being of drivers, but also hurting their own financial gain, which in turn pushes for Walmart to have potential of having to lay off slash fire employees over time due to the stance they have. So Darcy, very well said, very well written, and I'm glad you took an initiative to reach out uh, to Walmart themselves and, and try and get in contact with somebody. Who knows, maybe your call, maybe your email or something may may have a, a slight a slight chance of, of maybe making corporate possibly change uh, how they feel. Uh, in your part two to this, you said you wanted to encourage, you know, more drivers to go and reach out uh, to Walmart and stuff. I, I agree. I think they should on their own terms, but I am not going to say in a video, go and storm Walmart with phone calls and emails and stuff because I don't want to be, you know, responsible or something in case, you know, like uh, something crazy happens or whatever. But, you know, if there is anyone out there that wants to respectfully reach out and give their thoughts on it, that's completely up to them. Um, but I really appreciate you reaching out, Darcy, and sharing this information because, um, you know, let's face it, the fact that they are encouraging customers to not tip us is just asinine. Like, it's just, like, what? 
you know, DoorDash, you know, uh, what do you call it? Walmart has issues already, like I mentioned in that video, with drivers not wanting to pick up those orders to begin with, you know, let alone now. So, I don't know. It, it's just, it's pretty, it, it's bonkers is really what it is. But we'll see what happens. So, drivers, dashers, let me know your thoughts about all of this. Do you agree with what Darcy was saying? Do you disagree? Let me know in the chat or the comments. And of course, if any of you guys out there ever have anything you want to share with me, a topic, an article, a story, anything, send me an email, paytodrivestories at gmail.com. Best way to reach me. Or for a quicker response, you can reach out and message me through Patreon at patreon.com forward slash pay to drive. That link's in the description down below or in the pin top comment. So definitely go and check that out. Anyone who signs up as a patron is my way of saying thank you as I give you guys shout outs in all my new videos, which I'm about to do right now. So when you hear your name called, say, hey, Pete, I heard my name. All right. So we've got Samantha Michaels, John Birchfield, Brian Pomeroy, Brian Medina, Heidi Barnes, Ivan Jerome Gilroy, Joe Valerio, Angela Counts McCarty, Kurt Paul, Lee Peacock, Tulsa Todd, William Boudreaux, Laura Love, Agus, Tom Perry, Alan G. Van Horn, Lawrence Brown, Drew Hanor, Fernando Carranza, Frank Cavillan, Fresh One, Jason Casta, Justin Case, Lulu Laura, Natalie Mosley, Sarah Keston, Scott Reisner, Sherry Cassidy, Stephen Neely, Joyce Hine, Brian Richardson, Kenny Best, Ginny Thomas, Candace Mitchell, uh, John Bonacci, Matt Epperson, Nick G, Stacey Miller, Terrence Pacheco, and Valerie Brown. So huge shout outs to every single one of you guys out there. Really appreciate you all. Links in the description down below or in the pin top comment, like I mentioned. Uh, so yeah, who's going to be the next patron? Maybe it can be you. Let's find out. And of course, I hope every single one of you guys are signed up and are using the Get Upside Gas app. It's a free app for your smartphone. Very, very simple to use. Scroll down. Link is in the description down below. Look where it says Get the Free Gas app. And uh, like I said, it's very simple. You, uh, it, It'll tell you how to install it on whatever kind of phone, device, or tablet you use. And then from there... Go to your gas station, pump your gas, print out your receipt, take a picture of your receipt with the Get Upside Gas app. And within 48 hours or so, you'll get anywhere from 15 cents to 45 cents a gallon back, which is pretty fantastic. And if a friend or family member signs up using your code, you'll get paid every time they pump gas. It's called Get Upside. Links in the description. Make sure to download it today. And uh, yeah, everybody, simple as that. Um, also, if you guys want to get one of these awesome Comment 111 if you smash that like t-shirts, you can go and get your own at paidtodrivestore.com. We have lots of brand new designs, colors, sizes, you name it. We probably have it on sale every day. Paidtodrivestore.com. Links in the description or in the pin top comment for all your t-shirts, hoodies, and goodies. And of course, if you made it to the end of this video, leave a comment saying END343, E-N-D, 343. Just lets me know you made it to the end of the video. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below and turn on all notifications so you're always notified whenever I post something new. And if you wouldn't mind, hit that like button down below. It just lets YouTube know that I'm doing a good job. And uh, with that being said, everybody, um, you know, leave a comment saying liked, L-I-K-E-D. And until next time, get that money, get that honey, keep hustling, keep bustling. And we'll see you guys next time right here on pay to drive and pay to drive vlogs. And uh, as always, drive safe, be well, and we'll see you on the next one. Peace, everybody. Later.